Will? No. You? You. In parentheses. Put no. it in parentheses. No, you underline it. And it's in the sentence, so you don't have to do that. Now watch the verb phrase. Um. You. Will. will answer. answer. Now you take will answer. You don't underline them. You put it on that line next to the sentence. You write will answer. Underline you and put will answer on that blank line. The whole will answer? Yes. The whole word phrase. So underline you. And move will answer over. On um, main verb? On main verb, you put answer. On helping verb, you put will. So remember, the, the main verb always comes last in the sentence. Why? Okay, what's number two? Dr. Jones must have shown your sister the X rays. Okay. What's the <clears throat> subject? What's the subject of the sentence? Who's showing the x rays? Your sister? No. Dr. Jones. Okay, what, what do you do to that? Underline it. Okay, write it. Uh, do, write it down. No, I don't need to write it down. <coughs> so, one under underline Jones? Dr. Jones. Well, you're right, under Jones. Doctor is not underlined. Good job. I'll come. Okay, now what's the verb phrase? Um... Must have. And there's one more. Shown. Okay. So, what is shown? Is that the main verb? Mm hmm. Okay, so you write that under the main verb. What's must have? Have. Must have is the helping. So, I write must have. Must have under helping. Okay, you just go through those senses and do that. It's not hard. May Connie and I leave now. Okay. Connie and I? Yeah, that's the subject, so you underline that, right? Right. So you underline Connie? And I. One? Yes. Under each? Yes. Hmm. Well, come on, bud, it's obvious. Um. Now, what are Tanya and I doing? Leave now. Mm. May leave. May is the helping, leave is the hurt. Yeah. Now, it's just there. That's a sense of time. There must have been an accident on this corner. Okay.